Eighth grade illustrative math, unit two, lesson three, practice. Dilations with no grid. Number one, segment AB measures three centimeters. Point O is the center of dilation. How long is the image of AB after a dilation with A? Scale factor of five, three centimeters, multiplied by five equals 15 centimeters. The image of AB after a dilation with a scale factor of 5 would be 15 centimeters. B. How long is the image of AB after a dilation with a scale factor of 3 and 7 tenths? 3 centimeters times 3 and 7 tenths equals 11 and 1 tenth centimeter. So the image of AB after a dilation of 3 and 7 tenths would be 11 and 1 tenth centimeters. C. A scale factor of 1 fifth. 3 centimeters multiplied by 1 fifth would equal 6 tenths of a centimeter or 3 fifths of a centimeter. 6 tenths of a centimeter and 3 fifths of a centimeter are equivalent. D. A scale factor of S. 3 centimeters multiplied by S equals 3S centimeters. Number 2. Here are points A and B. Plot the points for each dilation described. A. C is the image of B, using A as the center of dilation, and a scale factor of 2. So start with A, and head towards B, and since it's a scale factor of 2, you would move beyond B one entire length. This is where you would plot the point for C. B. D is the image of A, using B as the center of dilation, and a scale factor of 2. So now you're going to start at B, head towards A, and move past A one full unit. So this is where you would plot the point for D. C. E is the image of B, using A as the center of dilation and a scale factor of one half. Start at A, and move towards B, but stop halfway. This is where you would plot the point for E. D. F is the image of A, Using B as the center of dilation and a scale factor of a half, we would start at B, head towards A, and stop halfway. It would be at the same location as E. Number 4. Triangle ABC is a scaled copy of triangle DEF. Side AB measures 12 centimeters and is the longest side of ABC. Side DE measures 8 centimeters and is the longest side of DEF, A. Triangle ABC is a scaled copy of triangle DEF with what scale factor? Well, 12 centimeters compared to 8 centimeters is the same as a 12 to 8 ratio, which is the same as 3 to 2 or 3 halves. The scale factor would be 3 halves. B. Triangle DEF is a scaled copy of triangle ABC with what scale factor? 8 centimeters compared to 12 centimeters. That's the same as an 8 to 12 ratio. An 8 to 12 is the same as 2 to 3 or 2 thirds. The scale factor would be 2 thirds. Number 5. The diagram shows two intersecting lines. Find the missing angle measures. A. What number added to 102 equals 180? A plus 102 equals 180. That's the same as 180 minus 102 equals A. And 180 minus 102 is 78. So A measures 78 degrees. B. B is the opposite or vertical to 102 degrees. B has a measure of 102 degrees. C. C is adjacent to 102 and is vertical to A. Since angle A is 78 degrees and angle C is vertical of angle A, angle C is also 78 degrees. Number 6. A. Show that the two triangles are congruent. You would reflect across the y-axis and move down 5 units. B. 
find the side lengths of DEF and the angle measures of ABC. The side length of D and E are equal to the side lengths of A and B. So DE equals 5 units. The side lengths of BC are equivalent to the side lengths of FE. So the side lengths of FE would be equal to 3 units. So FD would be equivalent to 3.2 units since side length FD is equivalent to side length CA. Angles DEF and ABC are congruent. Angle DEF is 36 and 9 tenths degrees. So angle ABC would also be 36 and 9 tenths degrees since those angles are congruent. Angles BCA and EFD are also congruent. Since angle EFD is 108 and 4 tenths degrees, angle BCA would also be 108 and 4 tenths degrees. Angle CAB and FDE are also congruent. Since angle FDE is 34 and 7 tenths degrees, then angle CAB would also be 34 and 7 tenths degrees. 